Hey everyone, and welcome to Norris Cove. I'm Yoshida here at the Cove. We're all about budgeting, finances, business, minimal and functional planning. But today we're going to be doing some cash stuffing in along with our budgeting. So let's get started. I don't like to hold you. You guys, I'm like super duper like proud of myself. Like I ain't dipped in like I normally do. Um, I think now that I have more to work with, you know, as far as income wise, this is working for me. I can really see my money. I put my money up, you know, during the week. That's why I have all these three different wallets here. So here, let's pull out this money. Um, this is like leftover from today. Okay. This, like in the middle of the week, I had some cash on me. I said, get it out of your wallet because I'm going to spend it. So I stuck it here in our pretty much bills wallet. So we got that. And we had, let me go through. What did we have there? I think we had like 160. Uh, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. Um, 50 and 60. Yeah, we got like 160. That was so close. And then here in my little cash dash bag, I have um, some money like I broke some chains. So if I break change, I'll put it in here. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. And also, the reason I carry this is so that um, if I get tips in cash, I can break it up, put it here, and then that way it's not mixed in with my other money. That's another way for it to kind of be out of sight, out of mind, and what I like about this is I can ball it up, and it goes in my purse, and I just don't know that it's there, so, anywho, let's get this money situated, the tr cash tray is back, um, so let's get started, I did not go, I went to the ATM just to get, like, um, the rest of my booth, when I thought that I had cash on me, but I wanted to get a 50, um, and my ATM allows 50s, so, that's all that I have. Everything else is I've kind of tried to get something to break change. And we're just going to work with what we got and pray it's enough. And that we can have enough in our envelopes to kind of cover stuff. So let's count. Uh, 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 150, 170, 190, 210, 230, 250, 270, 290, 310. I got a little lost. 310. Uh, dang, I got my calculator. 310, 20, 30. 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, and 41. So we have 341. Let's count it again. 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 150, 170, 190, 210, 230, 250, 270, 290, 310, 20, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, and 41. So let's put our money. Right, so the first thing we're going to do, we're going to stuff um, our wallets. I have my handy dandy cheat sheet, and here's a surprise. This sticky note will be in our May budget box. So, oops, show my cards. Um, garden is going to get 10. I had to make some change out of garden, so this is what I'll do. Let me see. We're going to get some change out of garden. I'll take a 20, put a 10. So now Garden has, so I had to borrow from it, and then I added something back. So we'll see what we got. We have 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, and 25. Oops, 26. So we're kind of just an extra dollar. I had to borrow from it for something, like make change for one of my customers, and I just didn't do it, but it's okay. We added 10, so we're kind of caught back up. I want to get, like, some rocks and something to make my house look better than not looking like the house, the trap house in the front products we're skipping today um gas we're skipping i just got gas again i think i'm just gonna let gas be a digital envelope eating out i'm up in my budget because i can and i'm gonna do 60 20 40 60 because i see that i have the money for it one two i'm always kind of over the budget and i'm only getting like two lunches out of what i was using so we're gonna do that Gives miscellaneous is getting 20. 
And one time, like, I use miscellaneous for different things. Like, I took my son to, like, the convenience store, got him some water before going to the gym, me a snack, you know, stuff like that. Um, even once I got my car washed and I used gifts to tip them, but I had, like, a dollar or two lingering here in miscellaneous, so I add that to tips sometimes when I go out. So we're done with this wallet. I'm looking for a new one of these wallets because these really work for me. Okay, we're done with the wallet. Let's get into this binder here. Make sure I'm, yeah, this is the right binder. One month ahead is getting 50. So we're just going to take this 50. So one month ahead now has 50, 100, 20, 40, and 50. 150 in the one month ahead. Excited. I'm going to have to catch that up. Next, we're going to go to the 52 week challenge. I realize I'm on week 14. So I'm going to put $17 in 52 weeks. That'll make me even, I believe. And I still may just have extra. So we have 50. Let's get it together. Yo, she said. In 52 week challenge, we have 50, 70, 80, 90, 95, 100, 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. So we have 118 and 52 week ahead. I mean, 52 week challenge. I think that I'm a little bit ahead, but it's okay. I want to keep the train rolling. I'm so proud of myself. Next up is the one in five, and one in five is getting ten dollars. So I'm gonna see if I can make change in the one in five. But everything else, I think I'm good. I do need to make some change. So we're getting putting ten in one in five. Let's see, five. Uh, let me see if I can do twenty. Here, I'll do this ten. Two fives, and I'll just add a 20. And if we need some more change, we'll, we'll do that. Okay, Christmas. I'm going to finally find Christmas. Christmas is getting 25. I need those. So Christmas is getting 25. Okay, we're done with savings. Our rate is getting five. Okay. Done with that. Uh, next, uh, let's see, birthdays. So I forgot. My mother's, I'm not doing nail. I did buy some nail stuff, but I'm just going to wait and add to this. My mother's 70th birthday is in November. Me and my sister are planning her a party, and we have things we have to pay for. My sister's putting the majority of it on her um, card, and I'm just paying her back. So this is 20. So my sister's birthday is actually today. So I took money from my mother's birthday fund, which was $50, and sent it to my sister for her birthday. So I'm putting 20 in here. And then the next birthday is my my birthday, of course, is the 23rd. And then my nephew's, my sister's grandson's birthday is the 29th. So I want to kind of build this up. I got a few weeks to build this up. So if I got to take away from here to like get him a gift or something, that's that. So equipment. We're going on to our business binder. So I'd already did a business video. But, and I wasn't going to stuff this, but since we had money left and we had some money to stuff, we're going to stuff taxes, first of all. Taxes is getting $9. Uh-oh, let's hope we got. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to put this 20 down. Wait a minute. Taxes will be getting $9. I... And then I'll take a dollar. That's it, Yoshi. I'll take the dollar. <laughs> Y'all, I'm old. Okay. What else we got? Equipment. 
LLC. Are we doing LLC today? We are. LLC is getting 50. 20, 40, 50. Oh my God, I gotta get this. I actually need a call because I think it's $300 that I need. So whew, we had 100. So LLC has 50, 20, excuse me, 50, 70, 90, 105 dollars. So that's that. What else do we have here? Equipment is getting 20. And shipping is getting 20. I'm gonna try to save weekly for that because I know this next um, budget box is gonna be, the boxes are gonna be a little heavier. So the shipping is gonna be a little more costly. So that's that. And then the rest is mine. This is what I'm paying myself to this week. Uh, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. And I'm actually going to take this and put in my 1 and 5s. I was supposed to have... Um, and business supplies, I'm, I'm so proud of myself, y'all, because I did purchase some stuff. But even though I purchased products for the shop, I didn't reach in here. It's just there. Nice hundred dollars. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put these in my one and fives just because and I'm gonna just pay myself twenty dollars. I may just add it to the miscellaneous fund. This is not the binder here, she did. I feel like I'm kinda of all over the place, but whatever. Um I'm just gonna add this to the one and five challenge. Or should I add it to one month ahead? I'm going to add it to the one of five. I'm going to tell you, they should stay up there. <laughs> That's why I had them upset. That's why I took, had you take them upset. I'm sorry. It's okay. It's okay. I'll pay you extra $5. That's all right. They're packed. I'll just get them up there. Thank you kindly, sir. Huh? Well, don't leave them upstairs there. Thank you. Okay, sorry about that, you guys. That's my son. He's helping me with the budget box. So he packed the boxes, shipped the I mean, fixed the boxes for me. So yeah, so this 20, I'm just gonna put in my wallet and I just may put it to um I'm just gonna put it in the bank part. But yeah, we like I'm so proud of myself, like really, really proud of myself. Like as I was doing my breakdown, I realized that I was like, wow, I've never, like, stuffed this money. I remember stuffing $65. Y'all know what? I think I'm going to throw that 20 in here in my little bill wallet so I can be a month ahead. I think that's what I'm going to do. Because it's, like, out of sight, out of mind. You know, I have a 10 here I'm saving in car. So I'm going to put this one in T-Mobile since I've started on car. this in T-Mobile. We have maybe one set of these envelopes left in the shop and more are coming where they'll be hole punched. Those are coming soon. So yeah, so this will be here. I'll let y'all know. I, want, I need to just go ahead and put it all in one thing, but once we get a little bit extra in our one month ahead we'll start that so here we go that is it thank you all so much for watching if again if you enjoyed today's video please do me a favor hit that subscribe button also hit that notification bell and i'll see you guys in my next video bye